Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I have my Ipsy and BoxyCharm PR unboxing for the month of July. And I cannot wait to see what is in here. So let's go ahead and just dive right in. So we're gonna start with the Ipsy Glam bag. And this is what the bag looks like. Super cute, I love that it's vibrant. But with it being 4th of July, they could have done like a patriotic kind of bag or something, right? Well, I mean, maybe. <laughs> so, all right, the very first item we have oh, is a liquid eyeliner uh, from Shades by Shan, and this is, of course, in the shade Black. I do like the pen look to it. That's actually kind of cool. Let's open this up and see what it looks like. Okay, so uh, it is just a felt tip liner which I mean they're okay I prefer the brush but um, this does look like it'd be precise Ooh, very thin line I do like that doesn't look to really be bleeding so that's a plus but you see how tiny that is uh, can you even see it at all <laughs> it's super tiny um, which I actually I like that because that means I can actually control it a lot better on my eye so yeah, I'm excited for this one, and it's a full-size item, so that's a plus. Okay, the next item is, ooh, from the Alicia Keys line, or Keys Soul Care. Uh, this is the Golden Cleanser. Okay. Developed in partnership with a board-certified dermatologist, this delicate golden manuka honey-infused facial cleanser is formulated with soothing turmeric and chamomile to help remove... Uh, makeup, dirt, and impurities, leaving the skin feeling cleansed, soft, and refreshed. Very nice. Why do I feel like this might be a full-size item? Oh, okay. It's tiny, but I... Is this... But I, it doesn't seem to be, like, super small. Like, not one of those little itty-bitty samples that we would always get. Um, this actually seems like a pretty decent size sample. Uh... Yeah, so I'm super excited for this. Now, her stuff can be very overpowering when it comes to the scent, in my personal opinion. Um, so if it does end up, I don't really smell anything right now, but if it does end up being way too strong, then I'm just going to give this to somebody. But um, I'll definitely test it out and see how that works. Another item is from an INH Fame Flame <laughs> Flame Fighter Heat Primer. Okay, so it's just a heat protectant for your hair when you go to like style it with the blow dryer or the flat iron or the curling iron or whatever it is that you use. You can always use more of this. Um, keep that frizziness down and you know want to protect the hair. So super excited for that. Uh, the next item is a lip scrub. Yes, I, lip, lip scrubs. I love lip scrubs so freaking much. So, who is this by? This is from, it says hashtag give them Lala, Lala skin. Hmm. Let's see what this smells like though. Oh. Doesn't really have, I don't know. Doesn't really have a distinct smell to it. But, looks like it'd be a good one. All right, we'll throw this in the shower, give this a try. Okay, and then the last item is from Floss, and this is a highlighter. So I want to say that I've gotten like a lipstick from this brand before, but I can't remember. <laughs> uh, so let's look at this. Alright, ooh, that's actually a really good size highlighter, you guys. Like, look at this. If I can open it, because I don't want to touch it. But look at that. That is a very nice size highlighter for an Ipsy Glam bag. Now the shade is beautiful. I definitely feel like I have something like this in my collection. I'm so sorry for my phone. Um, I definitely feel like I have something like this in my collection. So I am not going to um, keep this. I'm going to put this in a future giveaway. Let me turn this sucker off. 
Uh, so I'm going to put this in a future, future giveaway. And um, But yeah, it's really pretty. And like I said, it looks like it's full size. Definitely a, a very nice size, at least for the Ipsy Glam bag. So going back over this bag really quickly, we got the highlighter, which is a very beautiful shade. We got the facial cleanser, which is a, a really nice size. Um, we have the full size eyeliner. We got the heat protector. Um, and the lip scrub. So all in all, I think this is actually a really nice glam bag. So pretty impressed. Uh, let's see what we have for BoxyCharm. So let's move on to that. Okay, so moving on to BoxyCharm. Uh, if you guys are on Instagram and you follow I Ipsy um, and or BoxyCharm, um, they changed the box. So this is the new box and it's supposed to be better packaging, um, which I mean, this is still all I got. <laughs> um, this little itty bitty paper is all I got for BoxyCharm. As far as packaging goes, everything's still kind of thrown in here. Um, now I don't know if that's just because this is the PR box or if this, my, my personal one is going to come like this as well. So hopefully I get that soon and we can kind of like compare packaging because that was supposed to be, I do remember seeing that on their like video that it's like better better packaging or safer packaging or something like that. Um, okay, so the very first item we have is another product from the Keys Soul Care. Uh, this is Protect Your Light Daily Moisturizer um, with sunscreen. Very nice. I actually just got a little sunburnt yesterday and um, that kind of made me mad because I did use sunblock, but uh, I, I don't know what happened. <laughs> um, so I like the fact that it's a moisturizer and sunblock. Uh, because I tell you what, I can, within 15 minutes of being in the sun, I can already feel my skin burning, like on fire. So sunblock is extremely important to me. So, um, I do want to see what this smells like. I'm going to put a little bit on my hand. Okay, well it doesn't stink, so that's good. <laughs> I actually don't even, I don't even smell anything. Okay, smells a little bit like sun, like a sunblock lotion. So you can smell the sunblock in there, but I'm sure that might fade. It feels really good though. It feels really soft. Um, so I'm gonna let that sit for a second and see if that uh, light scent kind of fades away. I mean, it's not a deal breaker, but I just I want to see if it does fade. So uh, moving on. The next item is from Sweet Street. This is the Candy Paint Shimmer Lip Gloss. I don't think I've ever gotten anything from these guys before. I don't think I've even heard of them, so that's actually kind of cool. Uh, and this is in the shade Comet. Oh, that is so pretty. You can see all the like sparkles in there. I don't know if you can see it on camera. Let's do a swatch on the other side, not on the, the, <laughs> the moisturizer side. <gasps> Oh, that's so pretty. So freaking pretty. That is perfect for like summertime. You can see the shimmer in there. Just a very pretty color. Oh, I love that. Oh, I love that. Okay, that, that makes me happy. Okay, the next item is from Earth Harbor. Um, I've definitely gotten stuff from them before. And this is their Biome Brightening M M M Po. M -P -O? I don't know how to pronounce that. I don't, oops, I actually just tore it. Um, I probably won't be keeping this because I've gotten quite a few of these. Um, I think I've gotten this one before. So yeah, this is what it looks like. It's very fancy feeling and it it's glass. I love that it's blue. <laughs> I know that doesn't, that's not really a factor on what it does, but I do like it. Um, so this is for hyper concentrated treatment. Nope, nope. So this is Marina Biome Brightening uh, is named for the treasure ocean blue botanicals she possesses. Um, she harbors concentrated something or other oils that vigorously brighten and balance for an even radiant complexion. Uh, an overachiever, she works at a deep level optimizing skin's delicate microbiome to quickly and noticeably improve overall ap appearance of skin. Um, that sounds actually really nice. Maybe I won't get this way. <laughs> check and see if I have this one in my collection because I remember I think I got like a green one I don't know if I've gotten the blue one so I'll have to do some digging and we'll go from there okay so for the next item this is from lucky chick this is lip and cheek multi stick Ooh, 
in the shade Lucky Days. So let's see, this is what it looks like. And, ooh, that is a pretty color. I don't know, I mean, you would have to have a, a, a brush to apply this on the lips, but for cheek, that is, ooh, that's definitely pink. Um, I don't know if I would use that. Oh, I kinda wish I wouldn't have swatched it now. But, it's like a bubblegum pink. It would definitely be pretty on somebody um, in the summertime. Well, that turns into kind of like a light flush. I just feel like it would be too light. Um, I don't know. I just don't feel like it's for me. So, I'm going to pass that to a friend, um, see if anybody wants it. And, uh, yeah. But, I mean, it's still, I like how it blended. It looks really nice. It looks smooth. It doesn't look patchy. Um, so, that's actually really, really nice. But, just, just not my shade. And that's okay. And the very last item, oh, I'm so excited. I love when I get palettes from Natasha Denona. All right, so this is a Natasha Denona palette, and this is the Fez palette. And these ones are definitely a little bit more pricey. I think they're around like $50. Oh, I could totally be wrong, because it could be more than that. Um, oh no. Okay, so something did happen. I don't know if it was in shipping or what. So this is the palette right here. It's super, super, super pretty. I don't know if you can tell, but this one is loose, and it's missing, like, a whole... Let me see if I can get you guys to see. I don't know. It's missing a whole piece, like, up top. Um, like, some shadow is missing from the top. I don't know if you can tell because of the glare. Yeah, there, you should be able to see it. Um, I mean, I can press it down. That's not really a big deal. Um, but... It does shift. The whole thing shifts, so it has a, like a nice slice missing. Uh, but it's still really, really pretty. So I'm not gonna swatch it just yet. Um, I'm gonna do that a little bit later. I already know that I love Natasha Denona shallow, sh shallows, shadows. I cannot speak tonight. Oh my gosh. Um, but I think this palette is really pretty. So you have one, two, three, four mattes, one shimmer. You can definitely do different looks here. I do like the blue, the pop of blue, that's going to be fun to play with. Um, and I, ha I have like a lot of these little palettes and I, I, I love it. <laughs> so, uh, really quickly, let's go back over this box. So we got the Natasha palette. Even with this little minor imperfection, I think it is fabulous. I love that it's in here. Um, we have this little, uh, what was it, like serum? brightening serum. Um, so that's really nice. We have the lip gloss, which is absolutely stunning and beautiful. I love it. Uh, we also have the, where is it? We also have the lip and cheek stain, which actually blended beautifully. Uh, it's just not going to be a shade for me, but I mean, the product is still fantastic. And then of course we got the moisturizer slash sunscreen, which still has a faint smell of sunscreen. Not my favorite moment, but it's not like super strong. So um, I think, I think it'll be fine. Uh, but yeah, this box is so, pretty good. That's um, it guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And if you did like this video, please give me a big old thumbs up and I will see you guys next week. Uh, this is the fourth. So I hope everybody has a happy and safe 4th of July. There won't be a video on Wednesday because of the holiday. Um, I will be working all week long. <laughs> so, uh, you guys take care and I'll see you next time. Bye.